If we want to change action, we need to change perception. And if we are going to change perception, here's the upshot. We actually need to not just convince intellects, we need to recruit imaginations. It is not enough to be convinced intellectually, you need to be captured imaginatively. Then you will now inhabit the world as a space that is calling you to act towards shalom. So the big question for us is, how do we do that? How does that happen? How can we transform imagination? Here's the other piece where I think um, the last generation of evangelicalism has maybe not served us especially well. I think the church, and again, this is going to sound slightly ironic, especially coming from a philosopher, I think the church has actually overvalued logic and undervalued the aesthetic. We have actually, in an ironic way, overvalued thinking and undervalued the imagination. And until we revalue this imaginative, aesthetic, affective captivation, our imaginations are going to be captivated by rival stories. If we don't appreciate this, we are going to be formed by different narratives.